Have you ever gone for an x-ray, mammogram, MRI, or CT scanning in your life? I believe almost every one of us have somehow benefited from these medical imaging technologies. The imaging is so commonly used nowadays and may not look very impressive, but we couldn't deny that being able to look into a living body in details without having someone slice open is great and helpful in medical treatments. We began to realize that medical imaging segmentation has played an important role in medical diagnosing as we get to reveal a disease before we can feel the significant symptoms that may be too late to be treated at the time. What is medical image segmentation? It is the process of automatic or semi-automatic detection of boundaries within a 2D or 3D image. The result of segmentation can then be used to obtain further diagnostic insights. Possible applications are automatic measurement of organs, cell counting, or simulation based on the extracted boundaries information. In order to allow most efficient medical diagnosis, the speed and accuracy of the segmentation matters. The medical image segmentation done manually by the radiologist and expertise may have very high accuracy but there are some drawbacks since the cost and the time consumed is very high. With this, a method of AI named deep learning is introduced. So, what is deep learning and how does it apply in medical image segmentation? Deep learning is a type of machine learning that imitates the work of human brains in processing data and creating patterns for use in decision making. For medical image segmentation, a structure named Artificial Neural Network, which is ANN, is used to train and recognize the data for disease prediction, diagnosis, and treatment purposes. In 2014, Andrew Ng, the chef scientist at Baidu Research, once claimed that one reason that deep learning has taken off like crazy is because it is fantastic at supervised learning. But what is supervised deep learning? A supervised deep learning is a training process that uses annotated dataset, which is also known as labeled data, to learn before it could recognize and perform segmentation which with high efficiency. Just like how human brains work, we always need to be taught on the name or categories of certain objects before we could recognize and tell the difference between two or more objects. Taking an example by labeling all pictures of alligators and crocodiles. Deep learning will be able to learn the characteristics of each animal by itself and categorize the two animals accurately, just like humans. Looking back to the medical image segmentation using deep learning, it is still a big challenge since it requires detailed work other than the shape and size of the organs varies between humans. A large amount of annotated data is needed in order to obtain high accuracy of results, but alas, there is still no good solution to enhance or speed up the data annotation process, which could take up weeks or months to complete. Someone may ask, what about using unsupervised deep learning instead? So there is no labeled data required and hence it will become faster. Well, some researchers had started to figure out a solution to perform deep learning without using labeled data, but to the date, the algorithm is just not mature enough to apply in medical image segmentation since the accuracy of results is what we matters the most. Hence, in order to improve the function of deep learning in medical image segmentation, this project will help by suggesting a better method in segmentation using deep learning in most efficient way, where the accuracy of segmentation is kept high, at the same time the cost and time consumed is reduced.